guys welcome to my channel in today's video i thought i would show you 10 storage solutions that i've been using since we moved into our new home so in december last year me and my partner bought our first home together and i've always loved tidying and organizing and i like everything to have its own place but i love watching other people's videos picking up storage ideas browsing on amazon so for today's video that's exactly what i thought i would do just show you 10 things that i've loved using since we've moved into this house if you do like the video i would love it if you would give it a big like and subscribe if you want to it's free I'm going to be posting more videos about cleaning organization and my puppy so if that's something you are interested in I would love for you to subscribe I hope you enjoy the video and let's get into the 10 storage solutions so my first storage idea is this makeup bag so this is made getting ready in the morning so much faster I bought this off Amazon so it does come in a lot of different colors and patterns but this is great so before I used to have a makeup bag that had a zip and I used to have to put a towel down on my bed so it didn't move my bed in and then pull the makeup out so I could see everything that I've got. Whereas this opens completely flat, it's easy to see everything that you've got. It's a drawstring so the more that you put in it, the wider it expands. Or if you've not got much makeup, it'll just be really small. But I would highly recommend this product because it's coming so handy. So I bought this set of storage baskets from Dunelm. So it's a toilet roll holder and then two matching storage baskets. So I actually bought two of the toilet roll holders, one for the downstairs toilet and one for the upstairs bathroom. I love the colours of them. I love the fact you can get the two smaller storage baskets to match them. I like the idea of the toilet rolls being away so that you can't see them and they don't get dusty. And it holds the three toilet rolls perfectly. And then I've got the little matching storage basket just on the ledge in the bathroom there. But yeah, I just really like those. So the third storage solution is this iron holder. So sorry about the video, it's not the best lighting in the cupboard. But this has been great. This was from Ikea. I think it was about £12, something like that. So not too expensive. I love the fact that it sits high up. It's got its own place. It's not sat on a side or on the floor with the wire looking all untidy. It wraps neatly around the bottom of it and it's got its own place to sit in. So the fourth storage idea are these drawer organisers. It just makes the drawer look so much neater. You can clearly see what you've got of each item. They come in these really nice patterned colours, again from Amazon, so I will link them below. But I have mine organised into like my underwear, my different types of socks, so my cosy socks, my trainer socks, black socks. Um, it sounds a bit OTT, but it just makes it a lot quicker for me getting ready. I also use them for like, my tights, vest, bras, pyjamas, um, so those have been great. So the fifth storage idea is just a shoe rack. This has made such a massive difference to our cupboard before all the shoes were just piled on top of each other on the floor. We only had a small space here, so I was looking for a little while to get one to fit, but found this one in... Um, Home Bargains, I think it was from, for £4.99, and I've seen one very similar in Dunnell for £12. So that was an absolute bargain, but just looks so much neater. So the sixth idea is just baskets. I love baskets. I have a lot of baskets for different things, just so it feels like every item has its own place. So Ralph, our puppy, has a basket with all his toys in. I have a basket just for bags that I have when we go travelling toiletry bags and things. Number seven are these foldable storage boxes from Dunelm. So I had originally bought a set of two of these when we moved in then went back to buy another set because they came in so handy. So I use them for things like towels, bedding, the toilet roll and then I've got a spare one at the moment. I just need to finish labelling the towels and the bedding but I just like that you can clearly see what you've got. My partner can't say to me where's the bedding and where's the towels because everything has its own place in the cupboard. So the eighth idea is an upstairs stock basket. So before I add anything to the shopping list, I always check the stock basket. Um, I have one downstairs as well in the kitchen. So sometimes you might buy things in advance or if they're on offer and then in a couple of weeks you forget what you have and then before you know it, you've got three of the same thing just taking up a lot of unnecessary space. I don't like the feeling of running out of things so I often will buy a second product to have but then I don't like to overbuy. so this way before I add anything to the shopping list I'm not wasting any money and I know what I've got and what I need clearly. Number nine is this mop holder so again sorry about the lighting it's because it's in the cupboard so it's not the best video quality but this has been really handy I just love the fact that it's off the floor the clean mop doesn't have to sit on the floor and I just like being able to see the floor space um, and being able to clean it easily without having lots of things um, stood on the floor so you can do this for like brushes as well gardening tools so I think this is one of the command hooks 
Um, so I got this in Dunelm as well, so that has been great. And um, number 10, the last idea that has brought a lot of happiness to my life, sadly, is this plastic bag holder. So I was sick of seeing loads of random bags and just having drawers full of bags. Um, I just wanted a place for them all to sit, so I ordered this off Amazon. Um, it just makes it really neat. You shove them all in the top and then you can pull them out of the bottom. It's easily accessible. It doesn't take up much space at all. It just hangs in the cupboard here. Um, so that's been really great as instead of seeing them in all the cupboards or when you want a bag, you can't find one. So I would definitely recommend the plastic bag holder. And that is it for the 10 storage ideas. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave me a comment if you do like videos like this or know to make more of them. And I will see you in my next video on Monday. Thanks guys. Bye.